hopefully at 54, and go from there. It is what and, it is. I mean, and, and we keep it pushing. My, my thing is, and I, my thing is this. We all know, right, that Errol Spence is known for his jab. That's what he's known for. Mm-hmm. That's what he's known for. All right? That's what he's known for. Nothing else is jab and body. That's what he's known for. The jab and the body. They say he's got the best jab in boxing. One of the best, if not the best. That's what they say. Mm-hmm. Uh, it doesn't matter who he fights. Nobody stops him from throwing the jab. He gets countered, he still throws. All right, so what are you insinuating, though? You've been saying that your whole life. But what are you trying to say, bro? What are you insinuating by saying, okay, dudes took Arrow Jab away? Are you saying if something was wrong or Terrence Crawford was doing something dirty or something was wrong with Arrow Smith? What, what, what are you saying? He was drugged? Like, come on, not with it already, man. He, 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 fuck you are. Smash that flash card. But no, it's too funny. Before, a uh, hell of a fight. You know, uh, the thing is, <laughs> however it came about, they made it happen. We got it. And that was the important thing, like we always say. It's not yes. about, like you say, the outcome. It's about, let's have the fight. You know what I'm Facts. saying? Facts. Facts. So look, Facts. I got to go and be up. I'm, you know, I'm. <laughs> Can't nobody hear you, homie. Before is uh, Terrence Crawford, as we know, has great timing. He has those, hopefully at 54, and go from there. It is what and, it is. I mean, and, and we keep it pushing. My, my thing is, and I, my thing is this. What crafty? What master? I just want him I to be at his best and have different different aspects of his game where he can switch it up and make bud. And, and my man, Dirk James, I ain't been able to reach out to him and say. Do not know who you are. So if Correct. Errol beats this man in a rematch, now you know it's Errol. Right. They have right. a fucking trilogy and Bud wins. Now you know it's Bud again. Now we have the man. We have that now. And, and my man, Derek James, I ain't been able to reach out to him and say, you know, anything. But uh, I'm still rocking with you regardless. You know what I'm saying? He's my guy. Sure. Period. So, For you sure. know, uh, we, we go at it, win, lose, or draw. And we just get back to the drawing board and we get the next. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it is what it is, bro. Like I keep saying, bro, listen, bro, a win doesn't make you and a loss don't break you, bro. Right. That's and what it is. Man. Yeah, it's all icing on the cake, man. It's, it's, it's yes. pretty all green lights because my thing was after the accident, I could kill less of Earl Spence for another fight. As long as he's there for the long term for him and his babies and his family. That's and what's what's important for me. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Damn boxing. You know what I'm saying? But you know, if he can still do it and he can still get some money, hey, so be it. It's cherries on the top, really. And that's with really him and and uh Bud. You know what I'm saying? Because I got you no know, big. people make a mistake like we don't fuck with Bud. We just not fucking with the bullshit that Bud was doing. His the moves. silly shit. Him and Bo Mac mm-hmm. and, and Bernie and all that clown shit. We not we not entertaining that. You know what I'm saying? Facts. What clown shit? Facts, his yeah. moves. Yeah, we never take nothing away from Bud. We always say he's a hell of a fighter. You're lying. You, you, you're always taking something from him. How you don't take nothing from him, but then y'all say he ain't fought nobody. His resume was trash. The dude he's fighting was garbage. But then y'all don't take nothing away from him. These dudes talk like they double tongue, bro. They speak in double tongue. These, these dudes like this, you can't trust. Like dudes that... They say one thing, but you know they really mean something else. Those type of niggas to stay away from, bro. Dudes full of shit. Cause they clearly this this whole you you heard it all leading up to this fight. Almost every live this cat made, dudes was disrespecting Bud's resume. He fought bums and this and that and the third, but yet yeah, he's hell of a fighter. The thing about this fight was to really get an idea of exactly what level he's on because. We can't we can't determine that against fucking uh Amir Khan and, and Abonesia and See? See what I just told you. Now Abonesia did better than Aerospace did. You see how these dudes put their own fucking foot in their mouth, bro? Let's... You know, motherfuckers with a bullet in their knee. Nice. We, we just can't determine it. All right. Now you, you dumb motherfucker. You see he the, the dude that called in is an idiot too. Because now 
He talked. He just said, uh, "Dude, the bullet in his leg." That's that's Jose Benavidez that went twelve with Er with uh with Bud, bro. So listen, why did Errol only go nine? It's either this man. It's either Terrence Crawford is just that good, or all these dudes are just that bad, bro. <laughs> this right here proves to y'all that these dudes they have an agenda and they're full of shit. They. They don't like Terrence Crawford, bro. If you you, you judge his his competition, then I just I just explained that earlier. Then how is he the best fighting the best? How's Bud one of the best if you shitting on him for fighting Amir Khan? If you shitting on him for fighting Benavidez, he made Amir Khan quit. That's not Bud's fault. Amir Khan quit. He got Jose Benavidez out of there, even if it was a 12-round fight. Bro, so what he got shot. He got in the ring. He trained for the fight. He was he was the best that he could be in that ring, bro. Fuck are you talking about? But I I digress, man. I rest my case on these niggas, man. They, these these dudes, their credibility is shot, bro. Just by Terrence Crawford winning, he fucked all these dudes. Everything they've been saying is moot, bro. Throw all that shit out the window. I'm off this.